B'Shem Hashem Na'asev Na'atziach. Welcome everybody. It's the happy month of Adar and we want to start a happy podcast. It's called the Purely Positive Podcast. Hashem should help us to do it for many, many years. We're living in a generation where what we're trying to destroy this Shabbat Amalek is so powerful and people have anxiety and fear and doubt. And we wanted to give each one of you every day, Blinet, or two and a half minutes of pure positivity from the Torah. Why? This is uh, based on the biography of Rav Yaakov Kamenetsky. And he says that when they wanted to open the great Slobodka Yeshiva, the grand master and source of all the great Gedolim, the altar of Slobodka asked his Rebbe, Rabbi Saul Solanter, what should be the goal of this Yeshiva? He quoted a Pasuk in Yeshaya, to give life to those of crushed hearts and to give, revive those of a low spirit. And there's no limit to how many people have crushed hearts and difficulty and depression and lowly spirit. So, we, we, it's brought down in the Kabbalistic Sfarim that right before Mashiach comes, depression is going to be the main source nuclear bomb of the Amalek. So if Rav, Rav um, Riso Salanter, almost a hundred years ago, maybe even more, told the altar of Slabodka, which was the master pedagogue that created so many Gedolim, that even the yeshiva of Slabodka should be godless Adam and focusing on the positive, for sure us. The lesson for today is very simple. It says in the end of the Tehilim, Kol HaNeshama Ta'aleliyah Hallelujah. With all my soul I will thank God. The um, We can explain this, Chazal explain, don't read it, Neshama Ale Neshima. On every breath, thank God. So, our Mashiach, David, let's appreciate and work for the next 24 hours on this wonderful lesson that every breath literally, this is the goal of the entire 150 chapters of Tehillim, to bring us to such a high spiritual level that we appreciate, thank God, for every single breath we take. Because it's all a gift, thank you, 